Hi guys. So I'm going to do something a little bit different today and I'm going to put down some um, white paint here and we're going to spread that out and I'm going to use some Arteza's Pearl Sky Blue. work with this paint for now. I actually want to get a little bit of water blended in here so it'll help move the paint. Maybe a little too much. Now I'm going to use Arteza's Prussian Blue. How are you? My name is Sarah. Today we are working on a 24 by 24 inch canvas. And what I've done is done some uh, minimal swiping and blending on this piece. And I'm going to flood this because I'm going to do a ninja swipe. But <clears throat> the one thing about this ninja swipe is that I'm doing it on a transparent base. So I've never done that before. So there won't be any like blending with the base coat when doing this, I'm going to be working um, with just the flow trial to work my paints in. So this should be interesting. I've never done this before. Um, so what I'm gonna do to start is, let me see here, yeah. We're just gonna flood it. And once I get this all spread out and the canvas is good, I will get back to you. So just give us a moment and I'll be right back. All right, so my first color is white and honestly, we're not gonna really see much of that. Um, on here, maybe not, I'm not sure. Uh, I also have Prussian blue. I have cobalt, he, bu, cobalt blue as well. I have bright aqua green mixed with some metallic cobalt. I have golden's iridescent fine. And then I have a glacier blue by Arteza. So I figured these colors would look really nice against this. I was gonna go bright and vibrant, but I feel like sometimes that scares you guys, so. We are just gonna start here with some white, and then we're gonna go with some gold. And some Prussian blue. And a little bit of contrast in there and use the bright aqua green. And 
it maybe a little more cold. And cobalt blue. I love that color. And so we are <clears throat> gonna give it a swipe. I might actually start, because I'm using Floetrol as a flood coat, I'm actually gonna put some white down here. And if you remember the gradient of the color, the white was here, darker blues were up there. And all right, so, holy crap. I think I gotta go clean that up. <laughs> Danger zone. Oh my gosh. It's got a really cool design. All right, so we're gonna start with this. We're gonna take it down a couple of notches. Um, all right. Do that. Cute little flicks. I love what's going on here. There we go. And I am actually gonna come, I don't know what I wanna do actually. I was gonna bring this down already, but I kinda don't. I'm just gonna add that right there because I did get down to the canvas as I did right here as well. But when we pull this down, I think it'll be okay. So note to self, don't take off at 90 miles per hour for, for the first, first swipe. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to stretch this and bring it back because I don't want to have too much paint. On my canvas. It did make my cool piece over here disappear, but this is gonna be really cool. Oh my lord. All right, pardon my verbiage on that last swipe, but you know, what can you do? So I'm gonna add white here. And maybe we'll come in with some cobalt blue this time. And push in a little bit of white. I think I still want to use <laughs> use this one, um, but all right. There we go. Come in. Alright, so we're going to move this one back down this way and off the canvas. I can't wait to see how this turns out. Oh, I'm digging it so far. Like how far off am I? <laughs> <clears throat> I'm just bring the 
this down just a smidge. All right, now, oh, I love what's going on right here. Those are some pretty funky lines. All right, next colors. We are gonna start again with the white, I think. I'm gonna come in with the Prussian blue. Gold, Vista Blue or Glacier Blue by Arteza. White and then some cold. Yeah. A little cold. Oh boy. All right. <laughs> I'm like so nervous. <laughs> oh, that's awful. But we can work with that. We can work with that. gonna bring this back and if I don't like anything I can certainly scrape it off so let's see here love what's going on here and this is our right, right here. Just gonna blow that up a little bit. Okay. So we are going to move it. So now we're gonna do detail work. love what's going on in here. We've got some beautiful cell action. I'm actually gonna torch this real quick.
I'm done with <clears throat> blowing out areas, I can come back in and make them a little bit smaller with my stick. I'm really interested in how this turns out. This is gonna be really cool. Oh, I wanna blow that out actually. Hold on a second. love what's going on here. I kind of want to keep that. These details in here are just beautiful and I think it's going to look really fabulous against that very dark upper area of this canvas. So some of these lines may not even show up which is good because the flow trawl is so thick that a lot of it is sinking which is wonderful. Um, I know that one would think you don't want that, but I actually do. It gives a different effect and all the lines get really, really thin. This is super pretty. Uh, so I'm gonna bring you guys in so you can see some of the detail work. I actually like how it's a little heavier balanced over here because it's so light over here and it feeds into that um, busyness. So we're gonna bring you guys in for a close up and hopefully in a couple of days it'll be dry and we can show it on the next video. Okay, here we go. I love this area in here. And then when you come up in this area, I hope it's brighter on the screen than it is on mine, but um we'll see how it goes i love all this detail i can't wait for this to dry this i've never done a ninja swipe with a transparent base and i think this is going to be really really cool and really opens up the ideas uh, for future pieces so definitely this is going to be dark in here i know it looks light right now it's not going to be. There's going to be darker areas in here that'll show up on the white. So we'll see how it how it turns out. We got some beautiful lacing with the white in here. So, all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. And uh, we'll check out the dried results in a future paint, um, painting that I do. Uh, it's going to take a couple of days for this to dry in the studio because it is a flow extender, uh, flow trawl is, so it takes a little bit longer to set up. But uh, yeah, super, super happy and excited. You guys have a wonderful day. Bye.